June 7th. Don't slack off. Whatever you shall ask in my name, that will I do. John 14, verse 13. Am I fulfilling this ministry of the interior? There is no snare or any hidden danger of infatuation or pride and intercession. It is a hidden ministry that brings forth fruit whereby the Father is glorified. Am I allowing my spiritual life to be frittered away, or am I bringing it all to the center, the atonement of my Lord? Is Jesus Christ more and more dominating every interest in my life? If one central point, the great exerting influence in my life, is the atonement of the Lord, then every phase of my life will bear fruit for Him. I must take time to realize what is the central point of power. Do I give one minute out of sixty to concentrate upon it? If ye abide in me, continue to act and think and work from that center. Ye shall ask what ye will, and it shall be done unto you. Am I abiding? Am I taking the time to abide? What is the greatest factor of power in my life? Is it work, service, sacrifice for others, or trying to work for God? The thing that ought to exert the greatest power in my life is the atonement of the Lord. It is not the thing we spend the most time on that molds us most. The greatest element is the thing that exerts most power. We must determine to be limited and concentrate our affinities. Whatsoever shall ye ask in my name, that will I do. The disciple who abides in Jesus is the will of God, and his apparently free choices are God's foreordained decrees. Mysterious? Logically contradictory and absurd? Yes, but a glorious truth to a saint.